What's up guys, it's Hash Dead here. I'm never saying that again, it sounds terrible. Anyway, the whole point of this video is a high round strategy for three players. Or at least I had three players in my game. I'm pretty sure you could probably do this with four players, but we had three since we don't have any other friends. So, uh, well, let's get straight into it. Essentially, what you're going to have to do is have three people at the lander near Widow's Wine, where one person is at the back where my friend over there is just chilling in that corner and obviously one person as I'm doing is running a circle and one person is up by the window on the stairs you could also have one person uh, you could also have both people on the uh, on the outside like or in that corner with the, the yellow person in this game it was and that works just fine too but the only problem with it is that sometimes you get the odd zombie coming from the window near Widow's Wine, so the runner has to have uh, r has to be somewhat decent at running circles, so that they can just grab it from them, like like how I was doing. But uh, but otherwise, it's basically just that. It's quite it's quite simple. I recommend having stamina up, uh, jug speed, obviously. Widow's Wine is pretty useful to me. Uh, you may not want it, that's your call. I also recommend that the pe person running circles has a thunder gun, because that's always useful. And uh, essentially what the other people have to do is, while one person is running, the other people have to shoot with their uh, dead wire or fireworks or whatever they have on their gun. Preferably those two though, because those kill pretty damn fast. And that's pretty much it, since, yeah, it's a pretty decent way to conserve ammo, too, since multiple people, since the, the guy with the thunder gun doesn't really have to fire very much. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, you can probably switch between who runs and who doesn't, but rec I recommend having someone always, the guy with the thunder gun always watching the middle just in case because that running there in a somewhat smaller circle than you normally would is not always easy but as long as you have a competent teammate you should be fine and uh, that's pretty much it thanks for watching I am out